going to show you how to cut out an image using the app Be Funky. We were working on it for a short amount of time last time. So I want you to search dog photos because who doesn't like dogs? And we're going to practice on dogs. So what I want you to do is make sure it's photos. Um, you can click on images and kind of scroll through and pick the one you want. I'm going to pick this guy here. I'm going to view the image. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a screenshot of this image. On Max, the commands are different. I will have posted on the board how to screenshot um, on Chromebooks. Yours will probably pop up a folder and that will be easier access. And then I want you to take and go into Photo Editor. Um, it, it'll go to the Be Funky main page and then I want you to select Photo in Editor. Then you're going to upload from your computer your screenshot. So mine was in my um, documents, I think, screen. There he is. I'm going to open him up into uh, Be Funky. Now what I want you to do are use these crop, these tools here. You're going to be going in under this bar here where it says edit. See how that's flinging out there? These are the tools I want you to play around with today. Once you've cut it out, you can play around with whatever you have. But we're going to go to cut out because I want to get rid of the background. And that way you can kind of place things in different layers in different backgrounds and things like that. So this is just the basics of cutting. The shape selection, the lasso tool will kind of go around um, things that are slightly curvy. I really like the polyagonal tool. This is for round stuff, square stuff. So click this one here. And what you're going to do is you're going to go around the dog. So you're going to start at the front and it's going to drag a little string. So you can kind of see it's almost like a little spider web. And I'm going to click every time it, there's a little curve, you can kind of see where it's at. You want to click before you move it. I'm going to go in. So some of the really curvy areas, you want to do a lot of clicks so that it looks really nice. This is the cleanest tool to use when you are cutting something out um, on Be Funky. I'm going to go way over here, click. What you're, you're ideally doing is going all the way around him. You can hopefully hear all of the clicking noises that I'm making so you can see how much I click. Click, click, click. That's a curvy one, so click, click, click. Here, just keep going all the way around what you want to cut out. And this will apply to anything you want to cut out. When you get to the end, you double click it and the background disappears. So then I'm going to go to save onto my computer and then you can change the name of it to whatever you want. I'm going to select all and delete and I'm going to name it um, dog, uh, dog. I'll just do dog, but then you're going to save it as a PNG and then you're going to hit save. And then you can put it wherever you think that you'd be able to find it best. So I'm going to put mine in my pictures because that just makes sense. And you save it. I must have another one in there. I'm going to replace it. And there I have my dog without a background. Okay. All right. Well, that's the basics of cutting something out. I want you to see how you can do that. Um, then you can go ahead and play around with, you know, exposure or anything else that you want to do today just for practice. All right. Thank you so much for listening.